I did an interview yesterday and Juliana asked an interesting question. So now that you're out as a sex educator, how has that impacted your life? And I think in the wake of the Orlando shooting, you know, celebrities and people have been coming out about their sexual orientation, about what they do for a living. And it, it's like a time for honesty. Now, how does that impact your life? <laughs> <laughs> well, nobody could be further out than I am with my memoir, especially. I mean, with me, you get details. <laughs> uh, I have said for years that it's time for heterosexuals to come out. I mean, just to identify yourself. Bisexual, heterosexual. I'm a bisexual, heterosexual, lesbian, SM, leather dyke masturbating sexologist. <laughs> I don't think I can follow that. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can't be throw in the you know the JD and the Yeah, I'm your everyday, you know, entrepreneur, J D, civil rights advocate, First Amendment groupie, uh, bisexual, monogamous, married mom, self sexual <laughs> Who's into kink now and again? <laughs> Every now and then. Yeah. It's like, yeah, if you just think back over your life, we hopefully, by the time you're mid midlife, by the time you're 40, you've done everything. Yeah. If not, you're repressed. If you're one thing your whole life, that monolithic, like, I am oh. straight. <laughs> oh, please, please. Oh, and I'm divorced. I mean, we should throw that in. I'm coming out. I'm a divorced woman. Oh, married and divorced. I forgot. To, I left that one out. <laughs> because when you do that, it just neutral. First of all, people around you have permission to be themselves. Yes, yes. We can talk about sex. I mean, wouldn't it be nice if sex just became part of our everyday conversation? And it wasn't a big deal. And there was no like sex scandals anymore. And we actually had our politicians talk about issues, not who they were caught banging behind their spouses. The only back. time America can talk about sex is when a, a somebody who's famous gets caught beyond monogamy. I, You know, I think monogamy is an insane concept. But it's like, come on, uh, it, what about masturbation? That would you think anybody... Well, look at Pee Wee Herman, though. He got caught masturbating. He lost his career. I mean, the French laugh at us. Well, I It's a joke. Yes, it's a joke. Are. America is a joke. We are, we are ho, 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 ha, ha, ha. But what really is happening is that people are suffering. Well, and I was just going to say that. When I think of the Orlando shooting, I think of this young man that was raised by a fundamentalist father like I was in a fundamentalist home when there's one way to be. And when you're not that, it's the self-hatred, you know, that oh. ends up leads, it leads to violence. You know, and I, it's like I wanted to call out the political institutions and the religious leaders. It's like, let people be people. Let people be happy. Honey, America is not going to allow sex. I mean, that is pie in the sky. Well, on the way over here, I was passing uh, the TD Bank on 34th, and what is that? Park. Park, I think. And they had rainbow, just a rainbow banner across every window. Oh, nice. And I thought, wow, it's that simple. It's like we stand for certain ideals. And okay, ideals so we stand for oh, is tolerance. I, I, I have to say this. Why can't heterosexuals come out? I mean, why do you have to be gay to tell people who you are sexually? That pisses me off. We can all come out. Yes. And, you know, and when there's some kind of mass issue, like when something happens, like yes. we've just witnessed, it's time for everyone to have the debate and talk about it. And just being who you are and being honest about who you are to the people around you, its that's the revolutionary act. That's how simple it is. It's not anything difficult. No. Just, what is your favorite thing to do sexually? Right now, I'm definitely into my vibrator. Oh, and I had such a good orgasm yesterday. Oh. And now you've taken my dildos away. Yeah, we're, we're going to be doing an obsidian dildo. It, it, that's just like Betty's. We're going to call it yeah. the Betty. Anyway, so <laughs> the Betty. <laughs> I'm shipping it off to a 3D printer. And what if something be, happens to it? It gets lost in the mail. We'll be. It's fine. Okay. It, I believe okay. that it's going to be fine. Okay. I will join you in that belief. So, America, just be sexual. Get over mm -hmm. yourselves. I'm so sick of this. I'm gay. I'm straight. I'm bi. I'm queer. You're sexual. We're all sexual. And I would like to see the same vigilance that people who support 
unlimited <laughs> kind of guns in the NRA. I would like the same vigilance for people saying, no, we're not going to stand for it. We want gun control and we want people to be free to be who they are. Agreed. I think the pendulum is swinging. Well, how many more people do we have to kill? It's enough. It's enough already. It's enough already. So why don't we all have an orgasm celebrating human sexuality? Okay, kids. <laughs>